What's up developing prospects family? Today we're gonna to be going over a hitter's drill. It's something that every hitter should be doing. We're gonna be talking about three eye drills that I think every baseball hitter should be using. It's something that I used in my career when I was playing with the Cincinnati Reds. And it's something that a lot of minor leaguers, a lot of major leaguers focus on when they're playing baseball. And it's something that helps them get ready at practice and it helps them get ready at games. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. Alright, so I drill number one. I drill number one, all you need is a bat. And what the purpose is drill and what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be focusing on looking at the top of this bat and then focusing on a foul pole. What we're trying to do is we're trying to lock our eyes in on the top of our bat and then we're gonna go and focus on the actual foul pole itself. So from a distance, it's gonna look like this. I'm gonna stick my bat out. I'm gonna have my eyes in line with my baseball bat. And then what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to focus, I'm gonna have a soft focus on the top of this part of my bat. And then I'm gonna have a focus on the top part of that foul pole. And then I'm gonna be going back and forth, focusing on that foul pole, focusing on my bat. Do it about four or five times. And what it's gonna end up doing it's gonna help up, help you guys get those eyes focused and locked in for that baseball game. All right, so for the second eye drill, we're gonna be jumping into a baseball drill where all we need is a coach or a player and yourself inside the batter's box. We need a plate to be able to visualize what we're trying to accomplish in this drill. So what we're gonna be doing with this drill is we're gonna be in the batter's box and we're gonna be acting like we're hitting, okay? We're gonna have a coach that's probably five to 10 feet away. You can kind of play with it depending on how easy this drill is for you or how difficult this drill is for you. And what you're gonna be doing as a hitter is you're gonna be getting in your stance like you're getting ready to hit and your coach is gonna soft toss from right in front of you. Our goal with this drill is we're gonna to try to take our front lead hand. So as a lefty, I'm taking my right hand and I'm gonna to try to catch that baseball. So I'm gonna get in my stance, that coach is gonna to toss me the ball, and I'm gonna visually catch that baseball out front. What I don't wanna see is I don't wanna see you guys trying to catch the baseball here, and I don't wanna see you guys trying to catch the baseball here. We're taking our hand, just like we're hitting, and we're taking our hand straight to that baseball. So for the outside pitch, that baseball comes, we're taking our hand here, middle, here, and same thing on the inside pitch here. And so as that coach is out in front of you, what he's trying to do is he's trying to play and give you different corners and different positions of where that baseball is coming from. And for you, you're just visually looking at the baseball and catching it each time. As soon as you catch it, you can either throw it back to him or you can set it to the side. Try to go for about 10 to 15 of these, see how easy it is. If it becomes too easy, back it up and keep playing with it. The coach can start going a little bit firmer. So let's show you guys visually what it looks like when a coach is doing this to you. So for this third and final hitter's eye drill, what we're gonna be focusing on is we're gonna be in the batter's box again, okay? What's different about this one compared to the previous drill is now the coach is gonna throw that baseball underhand, okay? What we're gonna be doing as a hitter is when we throw this baseball and we're getting ready in that batter's box, now we're gonna be calling out where that pitch was when we actually saw it. But we're not gonna actually watch it go into the plate. We're gonna be using our peripherals to see where this baseball's coming from. So as that baseball comes, Coach is going to throw it, the ball's going to cross the plate, and I'm going to tell the coach if I thought it was the outside, the middle, or the inside pitch, okay? Now, what's different is, as a hitter, obviously, when you're watching that baseball, you're watching that baseball all the way into that, um, until that catcher catches it, correct? What this is going to do, this is going to help you visually know where that baseball's at. So, think about it on takes. When you're in the game and you take that pitch, you get here, a lot of times we don't necessarily follow it back into that catcher's bit, right? We see it visually and we know at about halfway through where that ball is coming over from the pitcher's mound to the plate that we're going to take that pitch. So this drill is kind of similar to that. As soon as that ball is thrown, that baseball is going to cross that plate and we're going to visually say if it's outside, middle, or inside, okay? I'm going to show you guys a demonstration right now so you guys can understand what I'm talking about. All right, so now I'm in the batter's box. I'm getting ready. The coach is about to throw me that baseball. 
middle. Outside. Inside. Now, if you guys notice, when I was going, I wasn't necessarily tracking the baseball all the way back into the catcher's mitt, correct? I saw that baseball, and as soon as I saw it out of his hands, I knew that that baseball was either gonna be outside, middle, or inside, and that's just because I've done this drill over and over again. If you guys take this drill and you guys put it in the games, you're gonna notice that you're starting to focus more on that baseball, and you're gonna start making it easier for you to track that baseball and start hitting the baseballs more consistently, because that's our goal out of all these videos especially with this video today, is I want you guys to see that baseball better. The better you see that baseball, the more consistently you're gonna start seeing those baseballs and hitting those baseballs. So we went through all three hitters eye drills that I think you guys can focus on and become a better hitter with these drills, right? So after going through all these drills, you realize none of them are too complicated. It's something that you can do at practice. It's something that I think you can take into the games and make yourself a better hitter more consistently because your eyes are seeing that baseball better. Once you guys get into slumps, you guys are gonna realize that your eyesight doesn't feel like it's always there. It feels like you're not seeing the baseball as well and that you need something to get you guys back into that rhythm, correct? This is a drill, all of these drills today are something that you guys can do to get yourself more in routine and ready for those baseball games to start hitting that baseball more consistently. If you guys got something out of this video today, let us know in the comments section below. If you guys haven't subscribed already, hit that subscribe button. If you guys like our baseball content, continue to keep watching our videos. We're trying to push out more videos to you guys more consistently. You guys keep developing.